Hello everybody, welcome back to another After Effects tutorial. In this one, very quickly, I'm going to show you how to add in a sun or sun rays into any video or animated photo. It's super easy to do. If I just turn this off here, you'll see here there is no sun in the original video. And then if I turn my adjustment layer on, well, there is a sun. So this effect is simple to do. I'm going to show you how to do it in about 60 seconds starting from scratch. Okay, so I'll delete all this. Here we go, we've got nothing. First step, go into your Finder or your Windows Explorer, grab the footage, just drag and drop it into your project panel. Now, drag that footage and just click on top of New Composition. All right, here we go. So what do we got? We got this kind of cool uh, drone-ish type shot, uh, just a lift off. Okay, nothing much going on. There's no sunshine in this though, other than a little bit over that hill. But I want a sun up here. How did I do that? First, go to Layer, New, and then you wanna go to Adjustment Layer. Once you've done that, we're going to go find our effects uh, and presets panel. If you don't see it, go to window. Make sure there's a check mark beside effects and presets. In here, beside the search option or beside the search bar, type in light rays. And you'll see something called generate and then it says CC light rays. This is the one that we want. I'm going to drag and drop it right onto the adjustment layer. So right on top here is fine. When you do that, you can already see that we've got a sun or something peeking out so we're already kind of on our way and for some of you that might be all you need to do but we can go further if we so choose now under the effect controls panel which is right here again if you don't see it you just want to make sure that your effects and controls panel is open let's go ahead and just move this forward and you'll see here we've got the sun and it's kind of doing its thing and it's it's not bad but maybe we want to move it okay let's keep going so we have a few options one and probably the most important one is the center if we want to move it up or sideways, all we got to do is move these two values. So I'm going to lift this one up into the air, into the little up, little higher, something like that. And then maybe just for, you know, I'll move it over to the left side just for why not. Okay, now I'll hit play and you'll see here we've got a kind of like a sun looking object. It isn't quite right though. We can adjust the radius so we can make it a little bit bigger. If you see that, you see we're getting there and you'll see it's a little brighter on the inside and then less bright on the outside. We can adjust the softness. So if we want it to be really bright, that's like a bright star where if we want it to be really diffuse, we just make it really, really soft and it's a subtle effect. You can go ahead and adjust this as you see fit. I'm just gonna go to back to around 50 just for this uh, image. And again, if you wanna animate your sun, for example, you can just click on this little stopwatch here. And then let's say at the beginning where the playhead's at zero, if I go ahead to three seconds, I can move it. So I'll just maybe move it down, something like that. So here's an example, right? So I'll just go back here at the beginning, it's up in the sky, and then as it goes down, it goes down and it does its thing. And I would probably wanna make this a little bit uh, less radius because it's a little bit too much through those trees. But that is the gist of it, it's CC light rays. You just add it to an adjustment layer. You can animate it, you can do all sorts of things to it. You could even change the color of the sun. If you wanted to have a purple sun, all you gotta do is go right up here. Let's just go right in here one second. I'm just gonna click on the adjustment layer, click on CC light rays, and then watch this. You just unclick these guys, and then you'll see here that it says color. And as I unclicked it, you don't you unclicked color from source. Let's say instead of a white sun, I wanted a red sun. Hey, look at that. Or maybe I wanted a sun that matches the one of the background, one of the colors from the movie or from the video. So let's say something dark and cool like that color. Now, all of a sudden, my sun is that color. How cool is that? That is all there really is to it, guys. So that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.